What's up guys, Dirty Saint here. I know it's been a while since I put up a video, but uh, finally gonna start it back up and I figured the best way to come back is with something new. I've had the uh, Don't Starve Reign of Giants DLC for a while now, just haven't had the time to play it. Um, for those of you who don't know exactly what Don't Starve is, the simplest way I can describe it would be uh, Tim Burton's Minecraft without blocks. Uh, pretty much almost the same concept. You, you know, gather materials, protect yourself from the weather, and, you know, it's a lot more in-depth than Minecraft, but, you know, I just, I'll just have to show you, actually. So, here we go. <clears throat> I'm actually playing it on the PC, too. I normally play it on the PS4, but, uh, I got the DLC on PC first, so I'm not gonna buy it twice for now. Plus, I'm actually waiting for Don't Starve Together to come out, which is the multiplayer Don't Starve. It's actually going to be pretty fucking awesome. So, anyways, here it goes. That's the douchebag who dropped us here. Alright. Like I said, it's just Tim Burton cartoon. Um up here you have you know the time of the day your hunger level your health and your basically your mental health right here um, uh, start by you know basic stuff twigs flowers keep you sane twigs and um, berries and shit like that you know where you eat berries twigs you use to create stuff my main goal here is to find oh there's a fucking turkey somewhere. Those motherfuckers are assholes. Like, they literally eat all the berries up, especially, like, when you need them the most. Ooh, carrot. So, I like to start off by gathering a bunch of twigs, a bunch of, uh, um, grass and stuff to make traps and, um, to make traps and then to make torches and stuff for when it when it gets <clears throat> dark at night if it gets too dark and you're like no light or whatsoever you get attacked by you know I think they call him Charlie it's basically the boogeyman let's see let's see what can I create okay I can create a trap I'm gonna get one of those and I'm going to need... Grass. Huh, that music is new. Kind of off-putting. I don't know if it really means anything. And... Hmm, let's see. I like to gather enough food and stuff to last me at least the first night and the first night I'm gonna spend basically running and finding um, a beefalo herd beefalo uh, if it's not painfully obvious basically like huge cow like buffalo creatures that um, for the most part you know if you build uh, something around them oh damn it if you build something around them like they'll protect you from most things like you eventually you'll see uh, these hounds come after you after a certain day, a few days, whatever. So, uh, let's see. I need one more. I don't need that yet. I need one more piece of grass. I actually need. I actually need a lot more. I need at least four more. I'm gonna be. Ah, here we go. Oh, uh, this little area, Savannah. So I might have gotten really lucky and found a beefalo herd. Um, already, they only go in savannas. I mean, you can you can herd them to different areas, but they mostly live in savannas. It's kind of dark, so the frogs. Ooh, a wormhole. Before I do that, let me... Okay, I got enough for at least two more torches. Let me see 
Oh, please don't tell me that this is only a little bit. Oh yeah, I'm fucked. This there's no way it be flows gonna be here. Maybe. These are rabbit holes. Wait, what's that say? Yeah, collapsed rabbit holes. That's new. At, in, at dark, the spiders come out and all that of other ass. Damn it! Other assholes. Hmm. No bee flow. Beehive. Those motherfuckers are. Fuck you up if you attack them. Especially the killer bees. There's a way to harvest them. I just. Nowhere near enough material. Hmm. It's a lot easier to click. Yeah, there's a spider's nest. Those are that's the asshole spider right there. When I get a chance, I'm gonna burn that motherfucker down. Check the map. Okay, cool. You run faster on roads, like it takes like twenty five percent faster. And there's man. And this is my first time playing Arena of Giants and I don't know if you guys noticed it, but there's a warning that pops up that says, you know, uh Reign of Giants is for experienced players and I'm like, come on now. I've been playing games forever. You're not gonna tell me I'm not an experienced player. It's like me putting it on easy, which I don't do. Everything goes right to hard. Oh well, that's what that's what she said. Um. Okay, dark. Oh, oh. All right. Best thing to do is to stay on the road. And I basically just run all night until I find a suitable place to set up camp. Holy shit! Why is it getting cold already? Normally, you have to wait till like winter time and shit before you have to worry about temperature or whatever. So, I guess in Reign of Giants, if it's, it makes sense, if it's dark, it's cold. I need to get back to. Where's that wormhole? I think it was right. Fuck, I don't know. Oh, that make, makes me nervous. So, yeah, and then if I run out of too much light, I just burn forces down. Like, who's gonna stop me? Well, there's actually a monster, you know, big... Oh, I set the fucking carrot on fire? Ugh. I need to get that so I can eat it. And it's raining. And my torch is going down a lot faster than it normally does. Okay, I officially don't like this as much as I thought I would. Daytime, so. Oh, cool. You get on the trees, you don't get wet. Oh, what is this? It's my wet meter. Hmm. Uh, 
Um, I have to do some research and figure out what the rain does. Bees. I don't assume that it's good. But I'm on a mission. I gotta find some beefalo. I can explore all this other stuff later. Can I build a fire yet? I need logs. In order to build an axe, I need. Ah! I need rocks. So now I'm worried because in all my games I've ever played, I've always been able to find beefalo pretty quickly. And going on day two and not having a base camp set up is damn it. Hit the edge. Unfortunately. Normally if you find like skeletons and stuff like this, they drop like, well not drop, but when they die they had cool shit. I don't get the H2O. Like... I need to drink something or... Am I missing something for survival? Graveyards, if you dig up the graves, they have pretty good stuff in them. But they also release ghosts, which are pains in the ass. What is that flying? Well, you guys see that? I have no idea what that is. Holy shit! Okay, can't attack those. Don't pick cactus. Cacti. Oh, my shit is wet. Soggy berries. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. That's the hound. That's what I was telling you about. Those guys are normally not supposed to come out 
for a while. Ah, oh, damn it. And it's getting cold. And... Alright, okay, okay. Whew, calm down. Let's see, where can I go? Uh, let's see if there's anything up this way. Keeping me warm? Yep. Alright. I don't know if I like wearing the giants that much. Well, I do. That's challenging. I just need to figure out how to keep my shit from. Ah! I need to pick those. Not fucking light them on fire. Hmm. Hmm. Where to go? Let's go straight up from here. Sanity is going down. A witness is going up. Mm. These guys take you to a cave levels. Where the damn beefalo? I will light this entire place on fire. Shit, 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 tree, tree, tree. We get too cold, start taking health. Yeah, obviously you get too close, you burn up. Oh, it's not raining. Day three, and I still haven't found. Huh. Hmm. Still haven't found a place to call home. Yeah, a little bit of swamp right there. Stones. If I were to die, you only get one life. And if I were to die right now, I will come back. I will come back to life right here. And this seems like a pretty decent place to set up my first camp, only because I can't find anywhere else. So, go to campfire right. Now. I got all my stuff to dry off. Oh, nice. Yeah, all my stuff is drying out. Well, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and end it here. I uh, appreciate you guys watching my first episode of Don't Starve, Reign of Giants. And uh, I'll see you guys probably tomorrow because I'm going to make a bunch of these. Later. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and check out some of my other videos.